Hello Capricorn, welcome to your almost daily love reading. This is Chelsea and thank you so much for subscribing to my channel. I appreciate your love and support. Cap, please bear in mind that this is a general reading and it will not resonate with each and every one of you. Time is an illusion in tarot, so this reading could apply to you in the past, currently, or in the future, okay? Cap, let's get to your reading. Today, I'm going to do something different. I'm going to divide the spread into two, one side for you and the other side for the person you're dealing with in love, okay? So let's get started. Spirits and angels, please show me important accurate love messages for Capricorn today. How does Capricorn currently feel about this person? How does Capricorn currently feel about this person? Please show me more. One of them is the temperance in reverse. Mm, okay. How does um, this person currently feel about Capricorn Spirit? How does, how does this person currently feel about Capricorn? On our deck is the Ten of oh, Swords. Okay, we'll see. Capricorn, don't forget that roles can be switched here, although this side is yours and this side is theirs, but it can be switched, okay? Temperance is in reverse. You don't feel very peaceful with this person. You don't feel very balanced or emotionally and spiritual balanced when you're with this person, okay? And um, with the Three of Cups also, it's, I feel like maybe... For some of you, not for all of you, you feel like this person likes to socialize a lot, likes drinking, likes company, okay, and you don't quite like that. And also, the King of Pentacles is in reverse here, so you feel that this person may not have been loyal, okay, and with the Ace of Swords right here, maybe you could have cut them off or have found out some truth or clarity about how this person is, okay, that this person is actually not stable and not loyal. Okay, you don't feel like they are, yeah, no, you definitely feel like they are not as loyal or as, as balanced, emotionally balanced or spiritually balanced as how they could, as how they should be because this is a king. So this person could be a little bit older, okay, a little bit older, older than you maybe, okay, and um, but, or this person should, it's like, <laughs> you feel like this person needs to grow up, okay? They, are, they still kind of like, they still like to socialize. They, you know, if that's a guy, they like, they like the ladies, they love the ladies, okay? A little bit of the ladies' men that I can see here. And with the Knight of Swords in reverse, um, yeah, they have, they could have been lying, okay? Could have been lying about the third party as well for some of you, could have been put you in a third party situation. If it's not about socializing and liking the ladies and whatnot, I feel like it's a third party, okay? I feel like you have already found out the truth. You could have cut them off. The two of swords in reverse, You've, you have seen things very clearly. Again, you know, you're no longer conflicted. You're no longer um, feeling like being blindsided by, by whatever that's going on. You know the truth already. And with the nine of swords in reverse, and I feel like Capricorn, maybe you are currently um, just trying to slowly... Uh, not think too much about it. I mean, the energy is still present. The Nine of Swords here, it's in reverse, but you know, you're, you're, I, I can see that you're slowly trying to heal here as well, okay? But of course, they see you as also, they feel that you are very hurt. You are very betrayed. You feel very betrayed by this connection, what, by whatever that's happened here. There's a betrayal card. Could have lied, could have cheated, could have put you again in a third party situation here. And the ending was very painful, okay? They see you as turning your back on them as well. Again, Capricorn roles can be switched here, okay? And the Six of Wands is right here. Um, I feel like they still see you as someone very attractive and that you've got options. And but they also feel that you are releasing them, releasing the burden pertaining to this connection. However, um, 
there's an eight of cups in reverse. Um, for some reason, I feel like they think you are pretending to move on, but actually you have not moved on. If that makes sense, uh, this is what they think, okay? And then the Nine of Cups is right here. Um, they do see you as being single, single, and you know, being self-indulgent, doing you, doing your thing, doing your thing, basically, um, keeping your options open and releasing this connection because it's too burdensome for you. However, they also could feel that, uh, I feel like they maybe they have a hard time moving on Capricorn. Eight of Cups is in reverse. They, they want to move on. They feel like that, you know, this should, that they should be moving on, but they feel kind of stuck, okay? Another thing that I'm sensing also, they could be, uh, could be, how do you say, could, could start dating other people, but they feel like it, the grass is not, greener on the other side hence they are still feeling stuck with you okay with emotions they have emotions for you okay um but some of the emotions are just it's selfish as well this person can be selfish or that they, they could think that about you okay again roles can be reversed but the eight of pentacles in reverse again they feel like you do not want to um work on this connection anymore and no longer focusing on it and the four of swords in reverse yeah i feel like they are very restless okay watching you maybe uh, moving on watching you you know um looking good as well keeping your options open but they definitely you you have definitely i see that you have cut them off after you found out some truth here but they are also very devastated i can see or they see you as devastated here let's see one more card mm -hmm. yeah again they feel like you have turned their back on them again it could go vice versa right and the nine of uh, swords um this is a feeling of just a sense of feeling stuck in your head um, I feel like you're trying to recover, you're trying to recover. Again, we've got the eight. Okay, so both of you can't quite move on. I feel like both of because we got the eight of cups, one on your side, one on their side. So both of you are still feeling stuck. Both of you can't quite move on yet, okay? Still in the process of grieving, uh, still in the process of trying to get these swords off the back, but I feel like with it being upright position, there's still a lot of, uh, still you're still feeling it, okay? And they are still feeling it as well. Like this, this did not, you know, it, it, I don't know how long this has happened, okay, that this ending between the two of you, but it still feels very fresh, as in, uh, it could be, five months ago, one year ago, whatever the case is, but the wound is, it still feels fresh, okay? Still has not been healed yet completely. On both ends though, Capricorn, okay? Um, this is your reading. I hope you resonated. If you did, please hit like, share, and subscribe. And also, I only do private reading, My, I mean, emergency reading. My information is in the description box below if you'd like to book me. If nothing else, I post a video almost every single day and I hope to see you tomorrow. Take care, Kat. Bye.